Hello, hello. This is a little bit different of a video. Um, I was sitting in traffic and I was like, you know, I know a lot of people that like post or like share just their thoughts and they post videos of them like in their car. And I do have like a little phone proper holder up thingy, which is obviously what I'm using because I'm driving with two hands. Um, but yeah, I just kind of wanted to, I guess just kind of share, um, just some of what God has like really just like taught me today and just given me a lot of peace about today. Um, I'm just coming back from the farm this morning and it is super hot outside. It is 88 degrees on my, I guess, thermometer on my car. Um, and like, I have just been so busy and, um, I guess within the busyness of the season that I'm in, I, I don't want to say I was like anxious, but I think I've shared it in my, I'm pretty sure I've shared it in my last maybe few videos or my last video that I am getting a puppy in about a month. And I'm really excited, um, but I know that that is going to cause a shift in my life. And um, I'm not sure if it's necessarily from just being an athlete and just always having like a schedule and a plan and whatnot. Like I, I thrive off of a schedule. Like I... Like I get up at five, I go to the gym at seven, I go to work at nine. Like, you know, you know, it's like, like I thrive off of like, this is what I'm going to be at this place. And that is not happening. Um, so one of the challenges in this season for me has been to learn one to just like let go of whatever schedule I thought that I had, you know, but at the same time, just know that like, and the same token, like the schedule that God has for me is better than anything that I could have thought. The help that God has for me is better than any help that I would have thought or would have tried to help myself with, if you will. Um, and I don't know, I think I've just realized that over the last couple of days, um, praying about something specific. And um, it's funny because I had asked the Lord to answer through, not necessarily through people, but just in communication with like the people that I was like communicating with about what I was praying about and kind of the question that I had. And he did, and he did it today. And I actually had a lot of peace about it, like myself. And I don't know, I'm just excited. I, um, it was just really good. So I, eventually plan to finish reading Genesis on here. Um, I just have not had time to sit still. And I think this video is one of the examples of like me sitting still with the Lord. And it just does not look like me sitting at home in my chair. <laughs> um, it is me in the car coming back, sitting in traffic at that. Um, but just coming back from the farm, which is a good ways away from my house, but I live in the city, so it would make sense why there's not a farm like in downtown where I live. Um, so they're actually doing construction on this interstate, which is why this is taking like a significantly longer time for me to get home. And when I get home today, I have a bajillion things to do outside to my home, which I am pretty determined to get done between hopefully today and tomorrow. So, um, I'm just always busy. That is like, that is reality. I wish there was like another way for me to put it, but there's not. Um, but yeah, I have really tried to enjoy where I'm at, um, just in life and enjoy the season that I'm in. And, um, I'm really grateful for like 
friends and just people that care about me like praying for me and stuff because it has been hard but I try my best to keep my mind like healthy and like focused on like healthy things um going to the gym has been great too um and just it's like I'm trying to fit all the things that I want to do within my life and days and working and um, trying to get ahead in some areas and things like that so it has been challenging but it's it's actually been really good and I would not have been able to do any of the things that I'm doing without the help of other people and so I think from me coming where I've come from and me kind of sorry if this is like jumping because I'm on a bridge but um I don't know, me coming from where I've come from and, and having the testimony that I have and just, you know, dealing with, like, people coming in and out of your life and just betrayal and people just being not great people all the time. Um, I think it's, I've been trying to no, not have this, like, everyone's out to get me mindset and this I don't need anybody mindset because that's not true. But I think when you've had your feelings hurt a lot and when people have just been not very kind, um, it can be like a safety blanket or a safety net, whatever you want to call it, um, to like think that way. But I have been really praying about just God helping me with my thoughts. And this is annoying. Um, with God helping me with my thoughts and just... Um, asking him before I assume something that I do not know to be true. Um, so, is this going to be jumpy the whole time? I'm just grateful. So I'm going to end this now because I 